how to add text in Camtasia Studio 2022 hey everyone welcome to how to browse our youtube channel in this video i'll walk you through the entire process so now without any introduction let's jump right into the video so just import your video right now you can simply tab on import video right here or you can uh, drag your video Okay, if you have a different screen or you just open your folder and you drag your video into the media bin the video will appear there and now from there I mean you just need to wait right now a bit now guys um, we are in media okay and we have I imported the video if I drag this video now down here now what you wanna do is to go to to head over to annotations and here we have a bunch of different things bunch of different um, uh, different phones we can add to our video and I'm gonna show you how to use them very simple but really effective and very easy to use. Uh, let me show you now first uh, you can uh, hear Camtasia it's got a bunch of different types of uh, shapes and text if you tab on this we have arrows and lines we also have shapes we also have blur and highlights we also have sketch motion and keystroke call out okay and here if we have bold abstract and if you select all now you'll be able to see all the shapes all right and normally normally or usually i use this this one very very simple now guys so let me show you how to add um, a text in your video so just uh, tab select now and drag this uh, here and now when you you can see here the text and double tab and now you can uh, write here something okay and now as you can see it shrunk itself when I wrote but you just need to double tab on uh, on this and now as you can see I mean here we have properties and just tab on properties and drag this a little bit down okay so that's how you add the text from here you can change the font area black regular blow bold you can also select a theme you can manage a theme a theme allows you to quickly apply styles yep and it's pretty cool as well you can create your own theme or you can import one just you can uh, add your own logo here Okay, this will disappear from your own computer. I don't have a logo right now, but you just need to create a logo and add your title, sub subtitle and text, and now you have a you have a pre-made background or something like that. So you can add here. You can change the color from here. Select the text and change change the title okay that's the one thing we added our title and now if you want to add an animation uh, here guys in color I forgot to tell you if you tab on when you change the color you highlight the words that you want to uh, change the color Okay, you highlight the words. 
but you can also tap on this to select the color from image if I select it and now I go here you can see you can see the color which is really useful I would say as you can see this is pretty useful as well here guys if you go to behaviors here you can add different effects let's say I want this double tab on this effect okay now drag this effect down here if you want to use this effect okay and I think it's pretty cool right as you can see Okay, or you can use this one. You just need to to drag this effect onto this text. Okay, now as you can see, you can also edit this uh, this effect. You can delete. This is where the effects will show up in this bar, and you can delete this effect. So now. If you go back the video is the text is normal without any effects but if you go back and you add an effect you'll see the effect here called shifting you can edit this effect from object erase okay smooth actually both no left and speed no it is really slow as you can see So that's how you add um, effects in Camtasia Studio. And if you go back to augmentations here, you can also add some uh, some different. Okay, the look the way your text will look like. You can increase. Okay, in here just double tab in here you can add your text. You can delete also the text you you added right click and now tab on delete or simply tab on the delete button on your keyboard you can drag here as well your scale opacity well so we can add arrows arrows and lines as you can see they're pretty useful when you're doing a tutorial and shapes can add shapes you can also blur something you don't want to show to others and here you can uh, increase or decrease the intensity here and there's another way a spotlight that's pretty useful as well as you can see and you can also blur something not blur but um it's yeah it's blur but more a bit different like pixelated blur it's pretty useful as i said when you want to don't want to show something okay we also have sketch motion these are pretty useful as well increase the thickness so you can see and then they're in motion draw time bit more slow works pretty well as you can see try to highlight oh, this to want to show someone this is what you need to do you need to tab on here and you show them this you need to tab on this okay mm, and you also have keystrokes here in keystrokes if you add keystrokes and you show your create a tutorial and you want to show them um, on which button you 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 typed not to type sorry you tab on which button and you simply here you need to add the the buttons okay or gray 
So that's how you do it. I hope this video, I hope this tutorial helped. If you did, drop a like and subscribe for more how-to videos. Thank you for watching. See you in the.